Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are back again with another video on a brand new server called Voidscape that just released about a week and a half ago or so. So we have normal mode, Iron Man mode, ultimate Iron Man mode, group Iron Man mode. We're going to go ahead and click normal Iron Man mode. Uh, there's no restrictions. I think Iron Man mode, you have restrictions. Um, ultimate Iron Man mode, you, you know, you can't use the bank and stuff and you only get one life and then... Group Iron Man, you can actually create your own group, join an existing group, and show existing groups. It's actually a pretty cool feature. I actually like that. Okay, so we go ahead and got our um, beginner gear category YouTubers. Uh, confirm we're not on there because we're not really, you know, we're, we're, not, we're not famous, you know. <laughs> Yo, what is going on, you guys? It's your boy Perplexy here, bringing you guys another video on a brand new server called Void escape before we get into this video we are doing a massive massive giveaway we're going to be giving away the best in slot cape in the game currently and this server just came out about a week and a half ago so this is a huge huge giveaway it gives 5 million in magic and range and then 50,000 in melee we also will be giving away one blue arsenic chest set which is absolutely insane also very 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 good especially for a week and a half release so guys to enter this giveaway all you have to do is comment your in-game name below make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel and make sure you guys like this video definitely hope to see a lot of you guys on this brand new server that just released about a week and a half ago there's so many customs so many sets uh, so many mini games um we're gonna be going over a ton of ton of ton of things like these sets look so so clean this is one of the sets and i absolutely love this set i think i mean i think it looks so fresh i mean that's amazing 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 model so uh definitely hope to see you guys on the server i will be putting their download link in the description as well as their discord link so if you guys ever want to check that out go ahead and click that link down below in the description um i will be making a door discord here uh momentarily not exactly sure yet maybe in about a week or so uh, so if you guys ever want to join my discord just click that link down below once i make my discord um if you guys want to catch my discord or shoot me a message whatever i will be putting more di my discord link um in the description down below as well so just check that out but i hope you could definitely see you guys on this server and i hope you guys enjoy this video peace guys before we get into this video though i do want to show off these sets because these are absolutely clean and i love them a lot i think they did a great job on the models themselves um super super clean but this is going to be the ninja set, which is pretty much the owner set. Um, I'm pretty sure it's like a custom set of one of the owners or something like that. Uh, but it's super, super clean. Absolutely love it. And then we have the divine cape, which you can get, um, I'm pretty sure, in game as well. And then we also have the owner set as well, which looks super, super dope. Like, look at that, man. Those axes are so clean, too. Like, the animation with the shadows, like just fading away dude that's so clean and then you have a youtube aura which is absolutely insane as well like dude they did such a good job on these sets man it's absolutely ridiculous so starting off at the home area they do have a daily task master that uh, would be over here to the east a little bit towards the home so you have your daily tasks uh so when you kill 100 hades uh you get 50 points and then if you do 25 bones to the altar you get 50 points so all these points, um, you can get a bunch of rewards. So you can get an OP donator key, which is really, really good. You can get bonds, uh, diamond caskets, owner boxes. And then uh, when you're on a streak, so like for three days, if you do tasks for three days, you'll get 300 points. If you're on it for five and then so on, you'll get a lot more points. So it's definitely, definitely, definitely worth doing tasks uh, just because you can get all these points and just get extra loot that you don't even, you know, have to grind for. It's just while you're doing tasks or slayer tasks or whatever it is, you know, you just run upon King Kongs while you're doing slayer. There you go. Kill 350 of them, you get 100 points, you know. Uh, kill 250 Ravenas. It's, you know, it's just, there's tons and tons, 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 tons easy tasks that you can do to get points. So if you guys definitely want to do that, just come right here to this daily. Uh, oh, a Pokemon boss has just spawned. So let's just go to May real quick. Trainer May. Oh, we got to get our prayer up. Our prayer is really low. We might get one shotted here. Maybe. Uh, what is it? Chronos play body and legs and helm, and then fairy crystals as well. And I think those are to upgrade as well for like pets and stuff. So we got two water crystals, not very bad. One on a seventy-five drop, so not too bad. Uh, so if you guys ever see that uh, animation pop up, just do colon colon May and it'll bring you right uh, here to May and then you can kill it from here. 
So if you guys actually come to the home area, um, kind of to the west, there's a battle pass uh, that you guys can buy. So you'll click this, then you'll go to the store, and you can buy the battle pass that way. Uh, so you have lots and lots of rewards. You have boxes, you have coin bags, you have regal mystery boxes, you have like overloads, um, bonds. It goes all the way up to a hundred, I believe. Uh, at 100, you get a Void Escape goodie bag and then a Scroll of Praise. I'm pretty sure these are really, really good. You also get a 25% lucky drop rate charm. That's absolutely insane. And then a two-hour double drop rate scroll. So you guys ever do want to buy the Battle Pass, just click this and it'll go to the store and you can buy the Battle Pass that way. Um, you can also buy from players in-game, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but all they do is just come to the home area and just go right here to the Exchange Battle Pass statue. So they also do have a vote shop as well so when you guys vote uh you guys can get a double vote pet um a bunch of scrolls a 25 drop rate lucky charm for 500 points and uh, a bunch of items and boxes as well as an abomination cape uh keys cash crystals and bonds so guys all you have to do to vote is do colon colon vote it'll bring up a site do vote and then do claim vote they also do have an aoe instance manager so if you guys want to enter an npc name you want to instance uh, you guys just enter that instance and then it will use an instance voucher uh so let's go ahead and just do for instance let's just do dark wizards uh so we're gonna go ahead and type in dark wizards it's gonna bring us and we're gonna have to pay a voucher with our aoe instance which we have 10 of those so we pay the voucher and boom we have an instance of dark wizards i think that's so so such a nice like handy thing to have because if you guys have too many people in an area and you're trying to kill something and then everybody just takes your kills all you gotta do is just use an instance voucher and boom there you go you have your own instance that you guys can do um and get a bunch of drops that way through your instance instead of just sitting there waiting for them to spawn uh you guys will just have a oh look at that we just got a five dollar bond um you guys will just have a instance for yourself where you guys can just kill them and i think it's actually like a timer as well so it's not like a certain amount of kills it's just on a timer um so that's really really handy as well i really like that feature because you know if it's like super crowded like i said earlier uh you guys can just do your own instance and kill monsters that way and it's a lot more peaceful you know what i mean uh so if you guys ever want to do that uh just go to the aoe little fairy and then use one of the instance vouchers i don't know exactly how to get them i think they're through bosses um and you can get them through uh i don't know coins or something oh we got a diamond casket or a diamond box nice let's go ahead and open that and see what we get we got two ice diamonds Ooh, dude we're getting so many drops right now holy cow just youtuber luck i guess <laughs> so you're probably wondering how do you get around a void scape well i'm going to tell you right now so to get around you're going to click this little icon right here with the v on it and it'll be your teleport interface so you'll have your beginner bosses your medium your hardened expert and then your maniacs as well as your mini games they have a ton a ton of mini games like so many mini games we'll go after we'll go over that in another video but for now um, so to start off, you're going to want to do starter zone. Once you do starter zone, uh, you'll get a certain amount of kills and you can move on to incredibles and then light reapers, serenic ogres, and so on and so forth. So it will be a kill count based monster NPCs that you have to kill to move on to the next NPC. Uh, you have your mediums, Darth Vader, no multi, which is really, really nice. You have lucid dragons, those look super sick, heated pyros, and then your hardens, you have herbal, rogues, exodian, uh, noxious troll, ravana, azale beasts, and then your experts, you have demogorgon. Uh, Yoshi, I really, really love Yoshi. Glacial Queen, Dream Flow Assassin. These look so clean. And then your Maniacs, you'll have Avatar, Scarlet Falcon. These are multi, these two right here. Uh, you have RA Mystery Man, Yura Isaya, and Obito Uchiha. Uh, super, super clean. I love, love, love these models. So if you guys ever want to get around a voicecape again, all you have to do is click this little icon right here. And you can also do previous teleport, and it will teleport you to your previous location that you were currently at this is one of the maniac bosses which looks super super clean i just wanted to kill it to see the feature of it um which i absolutely love uh so yeah just click this little icon right here you guys and you can teleport all around uh voice cape that way so we actually do have some boxes to open the feature off and show you guys the kind of loot that you guys can get from some of the boxes so we have 60 owner mystery boxes and one a grand mystery chest we're gonna go ahead and open the grand mystery chest first so here is the common loot that you can get. You can get the cloud pieces, uh, elemental capes, uh, a bunch of other gear, and a collector's necklace, which is really, really nice to start off. Um, uncommons, you can get a $100 bond, $50 bond, Tyler's Dream Pass, Unlimited Prayer Scroll, 20% uh, drop rate, 50% lucky drop rate charm, a Neo Aura. Wow, these Grand Mystery Chests are insane. And then the rare rewards for 5%, you can get a perfect ring, perfect necklace, owner cape, perfect necklace eye, 
a double kill count times two pet $100 bond perfect ring eye and an imbued sword so let's go ahead and open this and see what we get we got a cloud sword which is actually not that bad it literally gives you 2500 stats so i will take that let's go ahead and open these 60 owner mystery boxes uh we're going to kind of speed up the video uh, if we get something decent out of these owner mystery boxes i will let you guys know but here is the common uh it's pretty much all the same except the rare which is three percent now instead of five percent so you have the owner's aura owner bow owner staff um full owner pieces and then the perfect ring perfect necklace 100 dollars bond 50 drop rate charm and the tyler's dream pass so we're gonna go ahead and open some of these if we get anything good uh, i'll stop the video um and show you guys dude we got a perfect necklace literally like on our 40th not even our 40th one 39th we got a perfect necklace wow that's crazy three percent that is so rare We also did get a unlimited prayer scroll, which is also really, really nice. Um, and we got an E collector's necklace. So each piece of gear or item you get, um, you can salvage it by left clicking. Once you left click, it'll say salvage. So we're going to go ahead and salvage. We just got 30 or 40 tokens um, as well as 70 on my other ones. So we're going to go ahead and salvage this one too. So now we have 160 tokens. Uh, so you're probably wondering what you do with these salvage tokens uh, go over here to the salvage machine at the home area um, It'll be right when you teleport home. It'll be right here uh, here You could exchange salvage tokens for extra drop rate. You can get a maximum of extra hundred percent drop rate That's absolutely insane. So at 300 salvage uh, We can get drop rate. I think it tells you the drop rate when you exchange it um, I'm not exactly sure but yeah, once you guys get 300 salvage, uh, 1,000 salvage, 2,500 salvage, you guys can keep salvaging to get a certain drop rate. Um, and then once you're maxed on that salvage part, I think it will tell you um, the amount of extra drop rate you will get once you salvage it as well. But we don't have enough salvage, so we can't really do that. Um, but yeah, that's all you guys have to do is just come to the home area, go to the salvage machine right here, and you can salvage your tokens that way. I know a lot of you guys love Slayer, and they I do have Slayer on this server. Um, we're going to go over Slayer right here in a minute but i just can't stop looking at this flipping carpet slash rug it's just i don't know something about it anyways moving on uh for slayer so what you're gonna do is you're just gonna click here and you will teleport to your slayer masters uh, you can also select your slayer master depending on your slayer level so you have dirt at level 50 you have curdle at level 99 and you have simona at level 110 uh, we're gonna go ahead and click simona so we just changed our um, slayer master you can also change master by left clicking and change master that way um so here's the slayer items you'll have your slayer gem um i don't know if you can do a slayer as well but we're gonna go ahead and show you the rewards so you for 10 points you get slayer xp permanent double xp you can get 300 points um and then moving on we have boxes uh, a bunch of caskets uh bonds the one thing that i love is the nirvana slayer cape that thing looks absolutely absolutely sick for 3,000 slayer points they also have a dragon slayer sword and then a bunch of slayer helms um i think they're just all the same kind of helm just different recolored textures uh, but yeah, so you get to Slayer, you guys, all you're going to do is click this little thing right here and then select your Slayer Master um, and then whatever combat level you are, uh, you can go ahead and grab that one, especially with your Slayer level. Uh, I don't know what a packed bong is. I don't know what this is. Now that's some good shit. I just smoked a bong. I just stoned myself for 60 minutes. Uh, I ripped the bong for one minute. It boosts your drop rate 30% for one hour. What? what the heck that's crazy dude that's insane <laughs> also if you guys uh can't play the game or you guys have to go do something grab food whatever it is um come over here to the east side of the home area in the left corner um grab your bronze pickaxe and all you're gonna do is mine these afk ores you will get afk ore which you can turn into the afk miner uh, we're gonna go ahead and trade him and show you guys uh so holy cow you get a lot of things you can get ten dollar bonds five dollar bonds collector's necklace uh for fifteen thousand stardust so that's the afk or stuff uh mask of the dead which gives you 50 percent drop rate uh deluge potions i wonder what that does uh, it doesn't really tell you um you get morgan's vestas infernal pickaxe a lollipop uh tax bags and then a bunch of party hats and santa hats as well as a mario head so just for afking 
Um, if you guys aren't playing and you're not at your screen, just go to the AFK zone and just mine this AFK ore and you'll get the AFK ore that you need to turn into the AFK miner to buy uh, certain things. And you don't even have to play. You don't even have to be playing to get AFK ore, which is a great add-on uh, just overall. Like, you know, you're not at your screen and you want to make money somehow and you don't know how, just come to the AFK area and mine the ore. Also, if you guys do come to the home area and you come to the west side all the way to the left, you'll have a bunch of machines here. So you have your miscellaneous upgrade machine. Um, so if you have certain rewards or certain items that you have, you can get better rewards. So let's say we have a ring of wealth. Uh, you want to upgrade it to a lucid ring. Uh, you'll need 750 tokens and your upgrade chance will be 33%. If you want an infinite overload potion, you'll need... 50,000 tokens required to get e eternal potion, which will be 33%. So you do have a chance of losing certain things um, on here. They're not all the same, so they're different. You also have your armor, um, you have your miscellaneous, and then you have your weapons as well. Moving on, we have the battle pass, which I showed you earlier. There also is a salvage machine. Here is the forge machine. Uh, so if you want to make the banished slayer helmet, uh, you will need the Peacekeeper, the Natures, and the Thunderlight. Um, also, a bunch of other requirements that you will need as well. So, you want to make a perfect ring eye. You'll need the perfect ring eye, perfect bar, 100k tax bags, OP crystals, and then a bunch of diamonds. Uh, so, if you guys have all this stuff, uh, I would definitely recommend um, upgrading uh, your stuff to the better gear. Here is the blue arsenic that we're giving away, the chest, which is super, super good, as you can tell. Uh, just because of what you can get for upgrading it. So um, make sure you guys definitely do enter that giveaway as well. Here's the divine aura that we are currently wearing, which is probably one of the best auras, I believe, in game. Actually, is the best aura in game, I believe. Uh, so you only need all these auras as well as a 1 million tax bags, 50,000 blood bags, um, blue, blood diamonds, ice diamonds, smoke, shadow, and OP crystals. Uh, moving on, we do have the item combiner. Uh, so if you guys have certain items that you want to upgrade to um, better weapons, all you have to do is use those items on the machine and you can upgrade them. So if you want to get a exotic staff, you'll need a supreme staff, 25,000 tax bags, and the success rate will be 30%. So you guys might have a chance of losing that. So there's the weapons. Here's the armor. You can get Hulk. I like that. That's really cool. Detrimental, Stormbreaker, um, Exile, and then your miscellaneouses. So here's like your drop rate charms, um, your bags, your gems, your uh, caskets, boxes, whatever it is that you guys want to upgrade. So if you guys want to do that, just come to the item combiner. Over here, we have the keepsake ward, which I personally love. So if you guys have certain gear that you want to show off um, and you don't want to show off. So if you want to show off this gear and you're wearing different gear, all you do is come to the keepsake here, uh, select it on your keepsake and then put it as your preset and save it. Um, and then it'll show you that certain gear that you have on. Here is the info item gambler. So if you put a item in here and you roll between 0 to 100, if the number is greater than 60, you win. So if you win, you get two times your item that you gambled. So let's go ahead and try it. Let's use a... What should we use here that we have something really good of? Let's do owner boots. All right, owner boots. So we're going to go ahead and use the owner boots on the item gambler. You were unlucky. I rolled a 1. Oof, that's rough. Damn, we just lost owner boots like that. But if we got a 60, then we would have won. Um, and then it would two times my item, which is really, really nice. So if you guys ever do want to come over here, just go to the home area. Come to the east side all the way to the left. And there'll be a bunch of machines over here. So if you guys did get to the end of the video, the first person in that comments scroll on my video with your in-game name will get yourself a unlimited prayer scroll. Uh, it's just an add-on from me to you. Uh, just so you guys um, can get on letting prettier scroll super faster if you guys actually enjoy the video and watch the whole video But anyways before we end this video guys We are gonna be like I said giving away one blue arsenic chest and one owner cape to two lucky winners All I have to do is comment your in-game name below make sure you guys are sub to the channel and make sure you guys like the video I definitely hope to see you guys a lot a lot of you guys on this server Absolutely insane server. Um, I love it I literally just joined like three hours ago and I've been playing ever since absolutely love this server There's so many customs so many things to do so many upgrading machines um, Just a lot of mini games as well I'll be making another video on this hopefully on uh, mini games and going over the mini games and stuff But uh, if you guys did like this video make sure you guys like the video comment your in game below and subscribe to the channel Also, I'll be putting their discord link in the description as well as their download link So if you guys want to get there that super a lot faster click that link in the description down below and it'll bring you guys to their link 
Um, I hope you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Everybody get your fucking hands up.